Hello, my name is Dr. Hans-Jürgen Clemens from Motic Euro. And in this video, I'd like to show to you how to do the proper curler setup on our BA410 model. This explanation will be valid also for the BA310, 310 Elite, and the respective Elite model from BA410. What's the idea of the curler setup? The idea of the curler setup is to get a high quality illumination with a homogeneous background, improved contrast and reduced stray light. So how to do it? First of all, of course, switch on the microscope. The main switch is on the back of the microscope. Take your sample and place it onto the stage. Move the XY stage until the sample is in the ray path. Swing in the 10 times objective, which is coated with a yellow color. Adjust the interpupillary distance individually for your eyes only and focus until the image is getting sharp. Please make sure that the condenser head of the BF410 is in the ray path. The feed diaphragm is an integral part of every curler setup. It is built in in the base of the microscope. You have to close it until the edges of the field diaphragm are visible in your eyepieces. Now, please focus the image of the field diaphragm to the point where the image is getting sharp, means that the edges of the field diaphragm are as sharp as possible. If the spot of light is not concentrated in the middle, you have to move the diagonal screws on the condenser carrier until the spot is moved to the middle of the field of view. Open the field diaphragm up to the point where it's not visible at all. The last step of a proper curler setup will be the correct use of the aperture diaphragm, which is a built-in part of the condenser. Closing the diaphragm will increase contrast but reducing resolution. Opening the diaphragm will increase resolution but reducing contrast. So please use this diaphragm carefully. The complete procedure of focusing, adjustment of the field diaphragm and adjustment of the condenser diaphragm while at the same time centering the illumination has to be repeated for each objective separately. If you'd like to see more tutorial videos, please visit our YouTube channel or other social media platforms or just visit our website, multicurope.com. Thanks for your attention. See you next time.